Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to Emerson College polling. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe. And also, if you would like to support us, send a super thanks and super sticker. We would greatly appreciate the super thanks and super stickers and super chats when we start live streaming on Election Day, November 5th, 2024. Be here or be square because we are going to live stream the election polls as they come in from the major media outlets after we go to vote for the president of the United States of America on November 5th. You want to join the live stream. You're going to want to make bets with each other. You're going to want to send your super thanks and super chats and super stickers during the live stream to show your support for the candidate of your choice. Thank you very much, and let's get on with filling in that beautiful electoral vote map according to EmersonCollegePolling.com. Washington State, with 12 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon, with 8 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Hawaii with four electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada with six electoral votes. According to Emerson College polling, Nevada is has 48% support for Harris, 47% for Trump, making Nevada blue for Kamala Harris. Utah with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arizona with 11 electoral votes, according to Emerson College polling, Arizona has 49% supports Donald J. Trump and 47% supports Kamala Harris, making Arizona and its 11 electoral votes red for Donald J. Trump. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with 5 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. North Dakota with 3 electoral votes is red. For Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump. The first district of Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump and the second district of Nebraska is blue for Kamala Harris making Nebraska at large red for Donald J. Trump. Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas with 40 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Minnesota with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Wisconsin with 10 electoral votes according to Emerson College polling. Wisconsin and Michigan, which Michigan has 15 electoral votes. Sorry, they put these two together, ladies and gentlemen. In Michigan and Wisconsin, 49% support both candidates, so there's no clear winner according to Emerson College Polling's October statistics. Wisconsin and Michigan will not be colored in on this map. Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois with 19 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is light pink two clicks for Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance Hillbilly Eulogy. West Virginia with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Florida with 30 electoral votes, bottom right, is red for Donald J. Trump. Georgia with 16 electoral votes, according to Emerson College polling. In Georgia and North Carolina and Pennsylvania, 49% support Trump and 48% support Harris. So fill in Georgia, red for Donald J. Trump. And it says North Carolina 
is red for Donald J. Trump with the 16 electoral votes. And Pennsylvania is red for Donald J. Trump, according to these polls on Emerson College polling. I know we went out of order on that one, but they have these all grouped together, unlike other websites that we use. South Carolina with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New York with 28 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Maine is red. The first district of Maine is blue for Kamala Harris. Maine at large is red for Donald J. Trump. And New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Massachusetts, Delaware, Rhode Island, Maryland, D.C., and the rest are all blue for Kamala Harris. This gives Kamala Harris 230 electoral votes to Donald J. Trump's 283 electoral votes, giving Donald J. Trump the victory in the Electoral College, making him the next president of the United States of America, according to EmersonCollegePolling.com, with 25 toss-up states. So it doesn't matter if Kamala Harris wins Wisconsin and Michigan, Donald J. Trump would still win the election, according to EmersonCollegePolling.com. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are... Out.